All right, everybody, I want to finish up from our PLC this morning. You need to see what it looks like from the student's point of view. There are two ways students can turn in assignments. They can start right from uh, their iPad here. Uh, for example, this morning I made the reading response about turtles or something. And I'm going to go into, oh, not here. I'm going to go into my pages uh, and, and let's say I worked on it as a kid. Here's my assignment right here. Let me tell you why turtles are awesome. And I want to go turn this into that assignment I created with you in the PLC. I can tap the send to, which is up in the corner. Uh, it's a square with an arrow. And I'm going to send a, I'm going to open in another app. That's what I'm going to do. And in here, it's going to tell me what type. Hey, when your kids turn in something, don't let them keep it in pages. Have them convert it to a PDF. If, you, if they convert it to a PDF, it's a form of printing so that document can't be altered by you. It's a security thing. Also, it's going to show up in Schoology wonderfully for you to be able to annotate on and grade uh, if they convert it to a PDF. So now I have it converted to a PDF, and I'm going to open it in Schoology. It's going to pass me off to the Schoology app. And now I can either add that to my resources in Schoology or submit it to an assignment. In this case, I'm going to submit it to my fake section here. And it was at Turtle 1. Uh, reading Summary of Turtles. There it is. Now it just uploaded it off my iPad. And I get this handy dandy green uh, alert that says, oh, you've turned it in. And here we are. I guess uh, if I go into my courses. I'm going to go into my fake section and my, oh, and then I crash. <laughs> Let's go back. Try it again. And that, there's another way that students can turn in work rather than uploading it off their iPad like you saw. Um, I'm going to go uh, into my calendar on the side and see that on Friday I have the, as a student, I have the reading summary of turtles due. I'm going to go there and see if I turned it in. Uh, yeah, uh, let's see. Inf submissions across the top. I have information and submissions across the top. And I'm going to hit here. And yeah, I did turn in one submission. And it's revision one. If I, want, if I have time before the due date, I can turn in as many revisions as I want. But I don't have to upload a file. Way up in the corner, there's that blue... Uh, plus symbol. I'm going to hit that and I can create a submission right within the Schoology app here. I can also submit a photo or video from my camera roll so I can shoot video and then just upload it into Schoology. Uh, I can also submit it from my resources if I have stuff in my Google Drive. So I'm going to just do a plain old create submission there and this I can just do um, a writing response right on here. Blah, 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 blah. Turtles are so awesome. They have nice shells. Oops. I was using too many fingers. Let me go back. Too many fingers there. So I can do a written response without using pages or any other app. I can do it right in here. I can save it as a draft like this. Or I can actually, let's see. Yeah, I think I gotta go to revision too. See, it says draft right there, or I can hit the check mark and poof, turn it in. So know that you can have kids stay within Schoology and upload video or pictures that they take, or they can just do written responses right in Schoology. No need for other apps like DocAs or um, Pages for straight up written or journaling responses. Hope that helps. Time to get back to work.